Who's better, Jordan or LeBron? But if we mix Jordan and LeBron, what do we get? Superman, right? Nah, Lynn Bias. All right, so boom. Horace Grant said that Lynn Bias was the baddest MF he ever saw. Dog, Horace Grant said that. He was 6'8", around 220, and could jump out the gym. My boy was hurting him in the home of the Turpin. H to the Izzo. There's literally a Jay-Z line for every situation in life. Bias had epic battles with Jordan and the Tar Heels. He was bigger and just as, if not more, athletic than Jordan. He was taken number two overall in the 1986 NBA Draft. With Lynn Bias, the Celtics planned to extend their dynasty well into the 90s, but it was not to be. Just two days after the draft, Bias would die of a heart attack, brought on by cocaine use. His death forever shifted the landscape of the NBA. The man who would have been Jordan's most formidable rival had fallen before his sneakers ever touched the NBA floor. What would have been? 